What's up, y'all? I'm your host, DHR2, and welcome back to my channel. So, uh, for the first time, you're gonna hear me react. Well, you're gonna see me react to Jonah Lucas ADHD. Um, I think to me, ADHD is a disability, it's, it's a learning disability, and let's just say that it kind of makes sense, sort of way. I haven't heard Jonah Lucas's uh, song on uh, ADHD, so. We're gonna see how this is go. And if you're new to this channel, if you're brand new, and if you're just tuning in right now, make sure you subscribe and comment. And please leave a like and click that bell. So you'll be ready for some new content. So with that being said, let's get into some music. <laughs> You know, the part say the part where he said that he feels like he's dying inside because of his mental disabilities and he was trying to get by. He he's been like this is day one. Because whenever you're born with a disability, it's hard for us to, you know, feel like you're normal. And we feel and we sometimes feel like the whole world is against us some way, somehow. And this part is what I'm getting at right here. No, I don't need no drugs. Or maybe I'm different, and maybe my ADHD got me tripping, and maybe I'm just everything that you're missing. Yeah. Mm, he said he don't need no drugs. He don't need. He don't need no. Man. <laughs> he, he, listen, he, um, the part when he said that he doesn't need any drugs or any medications, I think it's probably because you're different from anybody else, and that's basically what I'm getting from this shot because. I feel like I said Jonah Lucas is like winning me over because of the way that he's speaking truths. So. You know, this part, I definitely relate to him because every day when I go to school or what, um, whatever it is that I'm doing with my life, you see, coming from a guy who has autism, I could definitely relate to his issue because a lot of people may misunderstand me for who I am on the inside. But if I tell them that I have a disability, that I have autism, They'll probably change the mind of how they treat people differently. So, in Jonah Lucas's case, whatever he do, and how he acts, it's because of his disability. So, you can't blame him. It's his disability. That's how I feel about my autism. And this part makes me think about how I am in life. The part when he said that don't cut me off because um because of my voice, I'm just different. You know, I hate when people do that. Sometimes when I try to have a conversation, like a casual conversation with people, when I'm trying to get to know that person, individual, when people want to cut me off for no reason, man, I just get upset because I feel like you're not really hearing me, you're not understanding me, and you're definitely not that. Well, not listening to me, what I'm trying to say. Because to me, I'm higher level because whenever I say stuff, I know I'm telling the truth. I know I make sense. But it's just the person who wants to shut me up because, well, I'm telling the truth because I'm speaking facts. I'm speaking from a man's perspective. That right there is what kind of makes me understand the song even more. Me, 
sometimes the way I listen to these music is I don't really catch what they're talking about, but I can listen to the song while reacting to it. Everything he says about his ADHD is kind of true about my autism. Don't anybody with any kind of disability is true. They're all the same thing, but the difference yeah. is his ADHD is similar to my autism, though. And <clears throat> it's kind of sad when a lot of people don't understand us. We have to force ourselves to explain to them about who we are. And it kind of sucks being a hip-hop artist in the music industry with the disability. But for some reason, I think a lot of people them don't really judge on judge you but well based upon your problems it's your disability so it's not your fault that you were born this way so makes it hard for me to listen to this song because all the stuff that I'm going through right now, you know, as far as, my, you know, what I've been through in the past with my disability because I sometimes feel like I'm not normal because I look at everybody who was independent. They know how to catch a train. They know how to catch the bus. They know how to do independent things and I rarely do stuff on my own, but at the same time, I need, like, certain support group or, like, travel training, for example. And I feel like in this case, he feel as if when people misunderstand, you know, misunderstood him for his ADHD, I feel like they're not understanding him and they're not really understanding me, you know, as a person with a disability because this is actually all true to what he's saying and... If anybody with a disability that is watching this video will understand where I'm coming from based on this song. Probably he said there's so many things in his head. That's like having so many negative thoughts in your brain. You know, you meet some positive people in your life, and then somehow the next few months or years, you're having some really crazy negative thoughts in your brain that's going to cause you to react. But mentally, you're reacting. Well, not reacting, but you have so many negative thoughts in your brain that has your mind talking the right uh, one ear out the other. This is like some heavy facts on this song, and this is we, and this is one of the reasons why I had to react to this because I need to know more about this song. This is a tight song. Um, I think when I hear this song, I think I'm going to pay more attention to this record. Not this record, but this uh, track. Um, it makes me realize that I am unique and confident, but 
there are some negative effects on it also. Like when people misunderstand you, not giving you a clarification, well, not, not that, but not really understanding you or, or getting to know you. That right there is what made me think about my disability as well. This is all relatable, I mean relatable, and this kind of makes sense in a sort of way. And this is just cold heart facts right here, you guys. So I want y'all to remember this. Whatever you're born with disability, ADHD, autism, bipolar disorder, you know, you're different and unique. So this one thing I can take away from this song is just be yourself. You know, don't let nobody tell you to be who they want you to be. Be the way you want to be. And if you do that, you'll be happy as a, as a uh, happy emoji. <laughs> oh, grief, I got so many uh, uh, notifications. Just ignore those, man. Just focus on the video. Um, understand the meaning of it. What are your thoughts on it? What do you thought of my opinions? And what would you, I mean, what did you think of the song in general? Uh, let me know in the comments down below. This is DHR2. And uh, I'm out.